Hello YouTube and welcome to another Windows tutorial. So today I'm going to show you how to access special symbols, emojis, smileys in Windows 10. So are you ready? Let's get started. So let's say that you are working on a text editor or in a text messaging program for example. And as you know we are often used to insert smileys emojis and special actually symbols so in order to do that very quickly in windows 10 it's really easy so actually all you have to do is to right click on the taskbar here so i will just click or right click on my taskbar and i will go to this menu here show touch keyboard button okay so now you will notice that an icon has appeared just next to the clock actually it's a keyboard here so if I want to access actually these special symbols all I have to do is to actually click on that symbol here so here we go now I have a full keyboard so I will just uh, open my word for example Microsoft Word so double click or just click on this icon here now I can insert my emojis or smileys. So as you know, there is here a smiley, so I click on it. So I have a bunch of categories that I can choose from in order to insert these special symbols. So I can insert, for example, the something like uh, here, like I'm sad, for example, or I'm happy, okay. <laughs> Once again, I can use other emojis or smileys. Like for example, here you can choose from a bunch of icons related to the food. So you can browse them, you can choose whatever you want. I'll choose this here, this avocado here. So you can choose from, so it's actually the quickest way if you want to insert some symbols or emojis in your programs here so here for example i'm using microsoft word so i have actually access to this menu here to this touch keyboard here on my screen and this one actually allows me to choose whatever smiley i want okay so that was just a brief or actually a quick tip that you can use if you want to insert but with the quickest way these emojis in Windows 10. But remember, it's only available in Windows 10, not in Windows 7 or other previous versions of Windows. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye-bye.